What is up guys? I am back. Temporarily. But, I had to come back to do this great unboxing that I've been waiting to do for a very long time. See, all the way back on October 8th, 2021, I ordered some things, including this shirt and two decks of cards. But the cards took a while longer than expected to print and then ship out and all that stuff. And so fast forward about 10 months since I ordered the cards, they finally arrived. But because of my luck, I had already moved out to go to school. They arrived the day after and I didn't come back until three weeks later. So now I can finally open them. I'm already getting all dramatic about this, my bad. So it's time to unbox. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm actually, I'm actually, um, very surprised. Holy crap. Okay, we gotta know, oh my gosh. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna, okay. okay. I know from Chandler, that says, enjoy the extra cards. We got, of course, an amazing Rise Magic sticker. Okay, so whenever I placed the order, as I showed earlier, I ordered one deck of Rise B1 and one deck of Rise B2. And I got a half brick of cards. We got three decks of Rise V2. Oh my gosh, these look great. And we got three decks of Rise V1. So, yo, I did not expect that at all. Holy crap. Oh my. Thank you so much. Uh, if Chandler watches this, which you probably will. Um, and now I feel bad, just just a little, because um, honestly, I got a little bit impatient. And also, shout out to Andrew McGrath for showing me this. SoCal had this amazing deal, $6 per Rise V1 deck. I'm, I'm assuming that's because of the long wait, which is very generous. And a big surprise. So I got a little bit impatient and I actually bought three more decks of Rise V1. For $6 each. So, um, as you can see in the background, I had five empty slots because I had bought, you know, these three Rise and one deck of Rise V1 and one deck of Rise V2. But now I need to make more space. I have nine decks of Rise playing cards. That's crazy. Andrew McGrath, I hope you're happy. So I guess now though, it's time to actually open up the cards. <sighs> okay, so I'm gonna open the Rise V ones first. This is not gonna make Rise Magic happy. But it's still opened. I know I'm very late to this party because everyone got their Rise V ones whenever they released. I did not get one at the time, so I took the chance to get one during the Rise V2 sale. Everyone who knows me in real life is gonna be like, what the crap? But <sighs> these cards smell great. So, uh, usually I throw the box, but we gotta set this one down gently because it's really nice. See, once again, I haven't had these cards. We've got amazingly drawn jokers based off of Micah 7 8. Very detailed. You've also got Chandler and Grant. And then you have the different pip on each card. You've got the double backers. Yeah, I'm very glad they did not just go with this as a back design. Crush stock. A little bit thin. Feels nice. Oh my gosh, I've waited. <laughs> so long for these. So I'm very happy to finally have them. Uh, moving on to Rise V2 now because I need to make this video not too long. And then at the end, there'll also be cardistry. So there's Rise V2 now. Might take a little bit more time on this because uh, not everyone has made a video on these cards yet. Second edition. This pull tap's better. That back design looks really nice. And actually, uh, Chandler flashed this on a live stream and I took a screenshot of it. I waited to share that Chandler flashed the photo 
until after the design was revealed. I didn't say this on the other deck, but you have that nice custom Rise Magic seal. I messed it up. It smells like the other deck, which is good. It's also very weird, but I don't care. I am a weird person, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> Double factor kind of card. You can do some great magic tricks. Borders are a little crooked, I will say that. Obviously, printing air. This is not a hobby. And this really nice red color. And then on the back, I cannot show it because it shows the marking system. Got a really nice ace of spades as well, of course. And so then they redesigned the special pips. But Chandler's still on the king of spades. Grant again on the king of hearts. Larger aces. That's really cool. The diamonds are darker. Then we get an actual double backer and a duplicate four of hearts. Ooh, that looks nice. Dribbling feels nice.
Okay, so that was a big surprise unboxing. Um, as you can see, these are all still open because I filmed the outro first. But anyway, thank you, Eyes Magic, and thank you to everyone who is watching. So if you like these cards, be sure to get you some. I think they're all sold out on Rise Magic, so you can go to XDEX or SoCal or probably several other card stores. I'm not even holding the right version. I might like the V2 better. I don't know. It, it, I like them both, obviously, for different reasons. So anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe. Um, again, I'm going back on a break after this, but I'll still be posting videos soon. And so... Yeah, stick around, and hopefully I'll see you whenever I post again. Goodbye.